Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another awesome video on the channel. In today's video, I have an amazing Ninjago Dragons Rising haul. I finally was able to buy me some Dragons Rising sets. I've been waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting for these to come out. I've been so excited to finally get my hands on these. And I thought I'd make a little haul video to show you guys what I've got. Um, as you can see, the first box is already opened right there. Because I decided to build one of the sets already because I was bored. So I just went ahead and did that. The other ones in there, there's two of them. I didn't end up uh, building yet. I just wanted to say my setup is pretty bad. I, I'm sorry, uh, I don't really have a dedicated place to do haul videos or build sets or set reviews or stuff like that. So I really hope you guys can bear with me. Yes, this is a blanket on top of a desk uh, thing because uh, it's very dirty for some reason. But yeah, without the rambling out of the way, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let's get into it. Let's grab the first one. Get in here with my garbage camera setup. I'm sorry, you guys. Uh, this first set right here, this is the one that I opened up and built already. Obviously, Ninjago Dragons Rising, the brand new season or the soft reboot, whatever you guys want to call it. Um, Imperium Dragon Hunter Hound. Um, this one I got my hands on mostly because of the figures, and most of these sets I got mostly because of the figures. But a lot of people didn't know I'm not really a Lego collector when it comes to sets. I'm mostly there for the minifigs, and the set is just kind of a bonus. So I tried to get the best value of sets that had the best value of minifigures in it. So, but yeah, so here is the thing. Um, this hound is, um, if I remember correctly, uh, they were using it to uh, stop the ninja from leaving Imperium. Uh, it was Sora's creation, I think. Uh, it's I watched Dragons Rising a couple of months ago and I already forgot. That's great. <laughs> but yeah, it's it was something like that. But overall, I think this is a pretty solid set. Comes with Lloyd J and one of the Imperial uh, Claw Imperial Claw General, so I just thought he was a traditional minion figure, which I guess he is. But let me show you guys the back here. Here is the back. You see, it's already opened. Um, here we have uh, just a showing of the wolf attacking the ninja with the. Uh, imperial uh general or whatever uh pretty solid set um when i get the chance to there will be reviews of these sets i want to get a review out for these sets as fast as possible because i want to show you guys cool builds and stuff like that so but yeah let's get on to the next one let's get into the next tiny one which is this one right here this is a very, 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 very 4-plus set. If you guys are wondering why I decided to get a 4-plus set, that was because this was the cheapest set that you can get Lord Raws in. So I decided to go ahead and get it. Also, it's one of the cheaper sets to get Kai out of. Uh, it's Kai and Raz's is car and bike battle. Again, this this one build wise isn't very like spectacular. I just got it because you know like getting Lord Raz is something that I wanted. Not only do I do I like the brand new Lord Raz character in the show, the potential for him to be from Chima. I saw his fig online and he's just a pretty cool looking fig. And I like to have them in my collection. So yeah, let me show you guys the back real fast. Here's the back. Uh, like I said, just the generic 4 plus looking thing. It shows the vehicles, the weapons, everything that comes in it. Nothing spectacular on this one. Like I said, just got it for the figs. Uh, but yeah, let's get on to the next one. 
All right, you guys, I'm back. This is one of the bigger sets that I got. This one, I think, was like $50, and I decided to get this one mostly because um, it's it's it was pretty much the only cheap set that came with Sora and Aaron. I wanted to get my hands on these figs because... They are part of, you know, the brand new season. They're the brand new characters to Ninjago. So I wanted to get my hands on them. The actual build, I think, is very cool. I like the vehicle in the show. I think it's very cool. It transforms into a mech. The figures overall is cool. Like I said, Sora and Eren, you get uh, Rapton and Baby Ryu, which I love that little dragon in the show. He's very cool. But yeah, overall, the build's cool. Um, everything about the set is cool. Like I said, I just got it for Aaron and um, Sora. Here is the back. It's showing you that it can transform into three things, which which is cool. I mean, you got to love the play features. And yeah, just a showing of them attacking Rapton. Um, but yeah, uh, these are the sets that i uh ended up getting uh thank you guys for watching stay tuned for the review of the sets and yeah thank you guys for bearing with me through my garbage one-handed recording and stupid setup but yeah thank you guys for all the support i really appreciate it bye